let's learn how to create beautiful, dynamic and animated gradients like this using PowerPoint. Let's start with a blank presentation. Apply blank layout. I'm also going to add large slide numbers. This is just for reference. We'll delete it later. Now we want a gradient. So go to format background. I'm going to use some existing gradient. I just want two stops because we are learning. Later on, you can make more complex ones. So one is light blue. And let me choose another color. So we have got this at 90 degrees. Now we want this gradient to move smoothly between slides. So let's duplicate this slide and change this 90 degrees to 180. Again duplicate, make it 270. One more duplication and make it zero. And finally, I'm going to duplicate the first slide and put it at the bottom. So we have one, two, three, four, five slides. If I just run it as it is, it's going to look very sad because this is going to jump to the next level of gradient. So how do we smoothen it out? By applying morph. The first slide doesn't need morph. It's the starting point. So we select slides 2 to 5 and go to transitions, apply morph. The next thing to decide is how long this transition should take. Two seconds is too fast. We want smooth animation. So I'm going to apply 5. In real life, it should be even longer. When there is transition happening for 5 seconds, what happens after that? PowerPoint is just going to wait for you to click to go to next slide. We don't want that. So we say after 0 seconds. Means as soon as the transition is over, go to next slide. And that slide also has a transition. So it smoothly goes on. The last slide should not go to next slide because there is no next slide. In fact, it will stop the presentation. I don't want that. So do not advance the last slide. First slide should go to the next slide immediately. Now let's run this and see how it works. You see, first slide moved immediately. Second slide is changing this beautifully to third slide. Now it is coming at the bottom. Now when it moves to the fourth slide, it will go on the left side. And fifth slide will come back to original state. Perfect. So this is how you create animated backgrounds. Now let's make it even more interesting by adding some shapes. One is a star and another is a rectangle. And I'm going to fill them with some different colors. And because I want them to interact with each other as well as the background, we are going to increase the transparency. And we want it to merge with the surrounding. So we'll go to soft edges. See what happens now. When these things overlap, they are going to look very interesting. In fact, let's move these guys to the first slide. And now copy to the second slide and make some changes. Change in orientation, size, or even the color. You can decide what you want. Now second slide to third slide. And again, make some changes. Now third slide copy to fourth slide. Again, make some changes. The last slide should have the same state as the first slide. Now transitions, timings, everything is already set. So let's run it and see it in action. Right now our timing is 5 seconds, so it is still a little bit jerky. But you can increase the duration to make it even smoother. Now we are happy with it. We want to export it. So let me remove the numbers. And then go to File, Export, Select Video. Choose the resolution you want. And now simply click Create Video. So it's going to create an MP4 file, which you can use anywhere. So there you have it. How to create animated beautiful gradients using Morph in PowerPoint. Try it out and let me know your feedback. And to learn more stuff like this, subscribe to the channel. Share this with as many people as you can. So that's it for now. See you soon. Thank you.